Great day, friends. What a great day it is to have a great day. It is Barry Dickerson. I want to welcome you to this episode of Dig In with the Dickersons. Alicia, well, she's not here right now. She's out and about running a few errands. Uh, but that's okay because the focus this week is on uh, real estate. So let's just talk a little bit about what's going on with the Dickerson Group. Uh, as I've talked with you in previous episodes, I explained the concept of farming. And farming is nothing more than taking a geographical uh, area or location and really focusing in on building uh, and generating new clients and new customers and new business within that area. And there is a unique area here in Florida that I have decided to focus on a little bit more. It's called the Fakahatchee Strand. It is a state park uh, here in Southwest Florida. And I put together a very short video talking about uh, the key uh, for landowners in the Fakahatchee Strand. So watch this video. Hello again, everyone. I'm Lieutenant Colonel Retired Barry C. Dickerson. I'm the team leader for the Dickerson Group at Cell State Maximum Performance Realty. Our office is located in Bonita Springs, Florida. I want to talk to a very select group of people. That's right. I'm talking to you, the vacant lot landowners in the Fakahatchee Strand State Preserve Park right here in sunny Southwest Florida. Now landowners, I want to inform you of the excellent opportunity that you have to be able to sell your land under the Florida Forever Program. The Florida Division of State Lands oversees the program. It is the premier conservation and land acquisition program here in the state. That's right, the Division of State Lands, they are actively seeking vacant lot landowners such as yourself to be able to buy your land. And since 1974, the state has invested over $8 billion, that's $8 billion in this process. To determine whether you have a vacant lot in the Fakahatchee Strand, watch this short video. The Fakahatchee Strand State Preserve Park is located east of the city of Naples, with its northern boundary being along Interstate 75 and parts of its southern boundary stretching and extending to the Gulf of Mexico. It is the largest state park in Florida with over 185 acres and 125 square miles. Now within the state preserved park, there are hundreds of vacant lots that the Florida Division of State Land are looking to purchase in order to protect and preserve this unique natural habitat. Now, the Fakahatchee Strand State Park is the largest swamp land in the United States and is home to plants and animals that can be found nowhere else in our country. Therefore, landowners, your vacant lot in this area is of value to the state of Florida. Now, the dollar value may not be what it was once projected to be, and the state will use a land survey and comparable sales data to be able to determine a current value to make an offer to you. If you own land in the Fakahatchee Strand State Preserve Park and you would like to sell that land under the Florida Forever Program, then contact me at the information below. The state's acquisition process is relatively quick and easy and you can have money into your account in as little as 90 days. I've had recent success with other vacant lot landowners in the Strand who are just like you. They didn't know about the Florida Forever program, they didn't know about their options, and they didn't know where to start. As an experienced realtor, I'm here to help. Let me be of assistance to you. Contact me today. I look forward to hearing from you. But until then, always think real estate. All right, so that's the Fakahatchee Strand. Uh, one of my newest areas that I'm focusing on. And I'm doing so not because the commissions are great. No, they're relatively small, but it's my way of trying to make a difference for those landowners. You know, back in the 70s, uh, those individuals, they bought the land with the expectation of retiring to Florida and living out their dream. Uh, however, and unfortunately, the shady land developers had no intentions of developing the land, building homes or communities but just to make money off of trusting individuals. Very unfortunate. Now, the state of Florida is focusing in on buying that land back so that they can preserve it. And if I can do uh, my part to help negotiate a deal for landowners, then I'm happy to do so. 
If this is your first time watching Dig In with the Dickersons, uh, Alicia and I, we would love for you to like and subscribe to our channel. Uh, share it with your friends. Uh, leave us a content. We'd love to hear from you. Next week, she will be back. We'll talk about what's going on in the Dickerson household and what's going on within our businesses and what we're doing to make a difference as we go through this thing called life. So until next time, remember today is a great day to have a great day. And I certainly hope that you are having one. Until next time, see you later.